Breaking news, an arrest and the stabbing of a popular high school football player killed while walking his little brother to the corner store. The 14-year-old was just starting high school in San Francisco. He was stabbed at the corner of Folsom Street and 26th in the Mission District, apparently after a fight on social media. KPIX 5's Ryan Takeo is at Sacred Heart Cathedral, where the news is quickly spreading of an arrest. Ryan? Alan, that's right. Police confirmed in the last hour there's been an arrest, and they are right now working on a press release, and they will give us some updated information soon, and we'll pass that along. Now, the freshman victim, he just started his high school career here at this school. Students were shocked during their first period by their teachers. We were surprised that police may be missing some key evidence. I, just, I had a shock through my body, like... No 14 year old kid deserved that. No. Jamar knows stabbing victim Rashawn Williams well. The two are schoolmates, football players, and cousins. And then when I found out that he, he didn't make it through surgery, it was just, I dropped my phone instantly. It was in tears and was crying. I just sat outside on my front porch for about an hour and I was just thinking about all the good times I had with my little cousin. It happened at about seven last night. Rashawn and his younger brother just bought candy at this Mission District Market. The clerk says he saw two younger guys waiting for Rashawn outside. One stabbed him in the chest, then ran off. Rashawn's mother took him to the hospital where he died this morning. Workers at the corner store say investigators might be without some valuable evidence. The store has surveillance cameras on, but workers told us the system was not recording. Police haven't confirmed a motive, but Rashawn's football coach informed parents it was because of a fight on social media and Rashawn felt threatened. Today, teachers broke the news to students at Sacred Heart Cathedral. After school let out, one of Rashawn's football teammates told us his team is devastated. It's hard for me because he's usually always there cracking jokes and stuff, so we usually just have fun, but since he's not here, it's not the same. He was a good kid. I'm telling you, his smile, if you guys would have saw a smile, brighten up anybody's day. It's definitely a family-like atmosphere here on campus. The victim's cousin even said the football coach came to the hospital last night to support his family. Live in San Francisco, I'm Ryan Takeo, KPIX 5.